guys what's up and welcome back to my channel if you guys are new here make sure you guys hit subscribe if you guys are digging the vibe and another thing make sure you guys turn on your post notifications right there next to the subscribe button the little bell so you guys can get notified whenever I post new videos now I post once a week right now but I am just starting to post two times a week so if you guys are interested in the feet community the feet world or just in general my world make sure you guys turn those post notifications on and give this video a thumbs up so once I reach 5k I'm thinking about starting to do money giveaways now I am a small youtuber but I do want to give back to you guys because I wouldn't be where I am right now without you guys so today's video I'm gonna be talking to you guys today about one of my most frequently asked question and that is a Google Play card and is Google Play card a scam? What happens if they ask me? Do I do I gotta go get a Google Play card? And whatnot. Now, I just wanted to get on here and tell you guys that a Google Play card is a scam. I have told so many people this from the beginning of the time till now, and I probably will continue to say this um, forever because that is just the world that I have, you know, accepted and come to terms with that, you know, I put myself out there and giving you guys advice. So uh, what did I expect? I'm going to receive the questions. I'm going to re receive all of the, all of the stuff. So yeah, with that being said, I do want to talk to you guys about what a Google Play card is, how they scam you out of the Google Play card and whatnot, and my experience. So a Google Play card is a, I'm gonna put it right here, it's a Google card that you can spend money on like apps and books and like movies um, for any kind of Android phones or devices. So, um, the way that they scam you is they ask you to go and get a Google Play card in order to put the funds on the card that you purchased. When you go and get the card, they ask you to give off the numbers from the back of the card, which is where they steal the money from. Um, it's not tangible money. It's a Google Play card. So money for anybody that has an Android phone, which is very, very smart because us newbies in the beginning are not going to know that a Google Play card is a scam because they are very smart. So I'm going to tell you guys about the experience that I had with a Google Play card. And I hope that after this video is released, you guys don't ask me too many more questions about a Google Play card. Because dead ASS, like I am sick of hearing about Google Play card because it's just the biggest scam there is right now. It's so annoying. I hate being asked about a Google Play card. Every time I hear Google Play card, it makes me cringe. So, yeah. Okay, so my experience with a Google Play card happened in the beginning of quarantine when I first started selling feet pics again. And I was at my boyfriend's house and I was on Instagram and this is when I got really thirsty for money. So in the beginning of quarantine, I decided that I really wanted to start reaching out to people and I was I was going to take my business for feed pics off of Twitter and more onto Instagram because I spend a lot of time on Instagram as well. So I wanted to see if I could benefit through Instagram, not only just Twitter. So I went onto Instagram and I hashtagged and searched the hashtag feed pics. And when I looked that up I found a lot of accounts that were posting feed pics and I saw a lot of people commenting under those photos. Now, in the back of my head, I thought, you know, most of these guys, they look similar, um, whatnot, but I was like, let me just see who is serious about really buying fee picks because the fee picks world is very broad, very out there, and there are a lot of people who do buy fee picks. So, 
when I when I started messaging people, they started replying, but all of them were saying the same thing about wanting to be a sugar daddy and wanting to pay me this much. And I knew that those type of things were scams, so I didn't even bother talking to them. But there was this one guy who, um, he was actually more talkative with me than all the other guys. So he was like, I will send you $2,000 right now. Um if you're serious about being like my feet baby or whatever and i was like wow like out of all the guys that i've talked to today i'm so happy that i finally found one that's really serious and so i sent my paypal over to him and he sent me a picture back showing that the money was pending however i've never seen a payment pending on paypal ever when they send you money so i was a little confused but then i thought well maybe it's because it's a lot of money so that's why it's pending because it's like two thousand dollars the picture literally had my little photo and my name and everything all the information was correct on there and it even showed it was good quality photo like it wasn't blurry like they edited it or anything um so i was really convinced so i got excited i told my boyfriend that this guy was gonna pay me two thousand dollars for fee pics and all i had to do was send him like some pics throughout the month and whatnot i was juiced off of it but then he told me um because i had told him i was like well why does it say it's pending i haven't received anything and then he said well it's because you have to go and get a google play card and then i was like well i don't i don't know what a google play card is i've never bought a google play card i don't have an android phone i have an iphone so i'm not familiar with what it is that you need me to do and mind you we're mid quarantine so i was very picky on when i needed to leave the house and what i left the house for so um i go on amazon and i look up google play cards to see if i could purchase one through amazon instead of just purchasing one like going to the store because i didn't physically want to get up to go buy a google play card so he tells me what i need to do because i asked him and told him i've never done it before he was very helpful guided me through the whole process of searching for one and buying one and initially he wanted me to buy a 50 dollars one but i told him that i didn't have the money even though i did have the money I told him i didn't have the money to spend on that that on that one so that I would get a cheaper one and whatnot. And then, so I bought the Google Play card, like a dumbass, but thank God my money um, got refunded back because I did like a cancellation on the payment after. Um, so I didn't necessarily give him the, the money at all, but in that moment, I kind of knew that he was trying to scam me out of the Google Play card and just take that from me. And I had spent like $25 on it. So after that, I told him that I got the Google Play card, but it wasn't working. I was flipping the script back onto him. And then um, he literally went like bad on me, started like telling me that I was scamming him and that I wasn't serious about it and all this stuff. And then I was just like, I don't have time for this. I spent... I want to tell you guys, I literally spent like two to three hours talking to this guy because I really thought he was serious. And that is the moment that I learned that I'm not going to waste my time on anybody who isn't legitly going to send me money for fee picks because I, I am a business person. So when I keep my word and I tell you something, then that is exactly what I do. But if you are out here trying to scam me and others, I will not stand for it. So I wanted to make this video for everyone that follows me and is subscribed to my channel to let you guys know that a Google Play card is a scam. I don't care if they're sending you a thousand dollars. I don't care if they're sending you three thousand dollars. However much m my mom is in the background really listening to some damn music. Mom, I'm filming! Anyways, guys. And I'm gonna end the video there, you guys. Because if not, I'm gonna get into it with my mom. Bye. Make sure you guys...